Hey guys, we're Philly and Keely, and for the last two and a half years, we've lived full time in our self converted van, Martha. We've taken her to a lot of places, but the last two weeks, we've been exploring Italy with our good friends, Beth and Jack. We've convoyed back and forth across this country, explored so many beautiful places, packed in so much stuff. We even weathered a storm. But now, the time has come for us to part ways. We're continuing our journey east, out of Italy, through Slovenia, ultimately trying to get out of the Schengen zone. We got rejected by that border. Thanks, Brexit. Here she is, fashionista queen over here. Um, for some reason, she's wearing socks and sandals. Oh, for crying out loud, am I going in this water or what? Slabber chops? Hold on, before you feel the water, what? I dare you, double, double dare you. For the people at home, right, hurry up, get sitting the on point. their sofas or watching this on their phone or whatever, run straight in. Yeah? Fully clothed. What? Just run straight in. And make my clothes wet? Yeah, so, so walk over to this stone. You want me to lie down in it? I don't want to wet my t-shirt. Oh, Philly. Tell me about my clothes. Okay, you don't have to. It doesn't matter then. I thought you were cool. <laughs> <laughs> it is so cold. <laughs> you know I was joking? <laughs> you just give in to peer pressure. Shit, it's cold. I'm coming back. I prefer a heart attack. <laughs> oh my god. That is so stupid. Help me! Wow, bigger balls than I thought. <laughs> it burns. It burns with cold. <laughs> I didn't actually think you would do it. Oh, for my love of YouTube. <laughs> there you go. That was good. If you haven't already, please subscribe. Oh, please, I'll be <laughs> so sick. And if you have any other stupid things you want Keely to do, let us know. That was good. Well done! Am I cool? <laughs> you said you thought I was cool, am no, I cool? You're the, <laughs> Let me know in the comments. You're the coolest person I know. <laughs> okay, now I gotta get out of these white clothes. Show me that walk of pride. Oh, yeah. oh. Is that your pride walk? Yeah, so pride! <laughs> this man is just breathtaking. Oh. <laughs> Good morning. Good morning. 6 a.m. here. Need some coffee. And then I'll tell you why we're up so early. <laughs> oh, hello. So, um. Uh it's too early for this type of stuff. <laughs> a proper good morning <laughs> over a coffee. So we decided not to cross the border last night for multiple reasons. Mm -hmm. One being the mountains are super beautiful here. There's lakes, there's rivers, and it's just like super fresh, you know. Mm -hmm. Our thermometer isn't saying that it's 30 degrees at 6 a.m. It's saying it's 22, so that's nice. <laughs> the other reason is because wild camping is illegal in Slovenia. Even though it's illegal in Croatia, we successfully did it last year. We were out of season. This year we're in season. Basically, we only have a couple of things we want to see anyway, so we're going to blast through there in 24 hours. We've only five days left on our Schengen and don't want to spend three of them editing. So we're just going to blast across, edit in Croatia, mm -hmm. and then explore there and beyond. Anyway, let's stop waffling. Let's go. Let's go. Ah! Feeling ready for this border? Ready as I'll ever be. So, just FYI, uh, we're almost at the border, so we've got our passports out. It's a bit dark right now. But if you're coming traveling, make sure you bring your V5 logbook. We almost learned this the hard way last year trying to get into Serbia and then obviously in Turkey and stuff as well. Some countries outside of the EU require you to have this to let you through the border with your vehicle. So, just be aware of that. Ready? Ready. Spud? We got this boo! Oops. Slovenia, 150 meters. 
That's an empty booth. Well, that was easy. We're in Slovenia, baby. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? That was like an abandoned toll road or something there. It's definitely very different traveling, you know, 2022 than it was, you know. <laughs> like that's getting all worked up on my borders. They don't exist. That, that's a past life. Borders used to be stressful. Now they're not really anything, are they? Okay, onwards. So our first stop in Slovenia is Lake Gled. We've heard from so many people how beautiful it is. So we're excited to come check it out for ourselves. But literally, even just a drive here is beautiful so far, isn't it? Yeah, I can see it. It's so so um, I believe, I believe people, I believe it's gonna be beautiful. One eternity later. Okay, so we think we found a park up that we're allowed. We're gonna go check this place out pretty quick because I think we're quite paranoid about getting in trouble about being a van. I'm tired. Do we want to make one more coffee quick before we go out? Maybe. Okay, let's do that. Guys, you know we absolutely love making videos. We always want to be leveling up our editing chops and be creative so we can make engaging videos for you, which is why we're super excited that Skillshare sponsored today's video. Some of the coffee shots you've seen in that montage we learned from a class we've just completed. If you don't know, Skillshare is an online community with thousands of inspiring classes for anyone who loves learning, wants to explore creativity, get new skills and invest in themselves. So for example, that class we just enjoyed was by a guy called Anki Badia. He's a travel filmmaker. He's got a great class on Skillshare all about making cinematic travel videos. So for us, we want to level up our editing but if you have a skill you want to learn, Skillshare is the perfect place to do it. Whether it's macrame, storytelling, learning how to keep your indoor plants alive, it has classes on everything. So if you're interested in checking out Skillshare, this is a unique opportunity to gain access to the entire class library for 30 days, completely free. So take advantage, click the link in our description, and I'm going to finish this coffee. Cheers. <laughs> excited? Sunny! Oh God, I'm excited too. Yeah. And we park in the sun because we're cool. Obviously. Stay safe. Stay safe. Apparently, you can rent a rowboat. You can get a little like group passenger boat over to the island. I think I might even see people in kayaks. I really want to get a boat and go out in this water. <laughs> I'd have to convince this guy. Let's go well, see how much they cost. I'm up for a boat. Yeah? Yeah. That'd be fun. Okay, so you can rent a small boat for 25 euros, a large one for 35. We're gonna get a little one. We get an hour and a half to go out to that island. You can also rent a stand-up paddleboard. And apparently you have to pay to swim here which Philly said earlier, and I was like, no way they charge you to swim. Apparently they do. Yeah. Also, should I let Kaylee row? Yeah, that'd be fun. I don't know if you've got the guns which for Which is it. more risky, me rowing or me holding the camera in a boat? Oof. I think you know. either way we're going in. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my goodness, we're moving. Um, what do I do? <laughs> <laughs> I'm serious. I want to turn right the way around. Okay. Look at this leg. Wow. Didn't actually give me a lesson on how to row a boat. I think that they thought it was pretty self-explanatory, but it doesn't seem like it is. <laughs> <laughs> I'm doing it! <laughs> Healy! I'm doing it! <laughs> Do I look like a pro right now? You look so pro. Somehow, we're on a boat. <laughs> <laughs> How did this happen? I'm just out of bed. <laughs> this is like my first lucid moment of the day and I'm just like came around on a boat. Someone's got a sunnies on, are you feeling like the man? <laughs> How cool am I right now? Can I have some cool music over me? <laughs> So I've swapped positions. I mean, this is the life. Now it's your turn. To the island, please, That's chauffeur. Something. Okay, show me what you're made of. Right, so I've got to turn this oar around. It's around the wrong way. Wait, am I doing it wrong way around? We're going backwards. Oh, right. 
<laughs> You're going back to the port? <laughs> look at me! I'm a boss or what? Oops, don't look too closely. Oh, that's a workout, man. Oh, that noise. Oh. Is a moose? <laughs> Do they have a moose here? <laughs> right, that's enough. My turn. Oh, Philly, please don't make no, me stop. I'm scared. My turn. Okay. Oh, I can step over you. Uh, I have no idea what's happening right <laughs> Is this is this um, the way that people do it on sailboats? <laughs> you just crawl through each other's legs. Row your boat gently down the stream. Night and night and It's not a dream. Bloody sweating here. <laughs> okay, I'll let this guy take over and we'll we'll find you at the island. a bit stressful. <laughs> I'm not a skipper by any means. I just don't understand the science of how that water's so blue. It looks like a slush puppy. <laughs> a slush puppy? It does, it's so blue. It is really blue. So what is your, what, what's your first um, impressions? impressions of Slovenia? Oh my word, Slovenia is gorgeous. It actually is gorgeous. So anyone who's like thinks you're just going to beeline through here, unlike us we have to because of Schengen, if you have time it's so far so beautiful. I've only been in like an hour across the border. <laughs> yeah. Honestly. And we're already in a boat. Yeah, what the frig? Look at us <laughs> go. That's what happens when we get up early. Guys, look at this view. Incredible. Look, ooh, look at this view. Incredible. <laughs> <laughs> Easy. Why do you make that look so smooth? Okay, so it's official. Lake Bled is actually really beautiful. And it's definitely worth the stop off if you're coming through Slovenia, especially from Northern Italy, because you're basically going past it. Very beautiful. Come as early as possible in the morning so there's less people about. I'll bring somebody else to row for you. Yeah. <laughs> Look at this guy. Mm -mm -mm. I've got the rhythm, I've got the rhythm noise. You got the rhythm of the night. Blitz in it. Okay, I'm gonna turn this off. You're gonna have that level there. Woo! No, bye bye. Woo! So we're back. That only took like five minutes that time. No, it didn't. Did it? <laughs> no. Okay. It felt like twice as long. It did. To the point where I was like, we went to the wrong side of the lake. <laughs> Back it up. We're live. There you go. You did good. That was very fun. Yeah, it actually was. So that was good. a fun experience. We've never done anything like that before, so it was really no. cool. That was awesome. That was worth 25 euros for sure, in yeah. my opinion. Come early. Yeah. Because it's now like half 12 and it's starting to get pretty busy. Yeah, it's a big queue for the boats and a wait and everything, so yeah. early as possible. Let's go. Let's go see some more stuff, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, it's very hot. We've got like a 20 minute walk from here to the first vegan spot I want to check out. Stay safe. Oh, baby. I'm very happy. I'm not flapping in ages. So far, this city is friggin' awesome. It's ridiculously hot, but let's explore. Hello. That tastes like a liquid brownie of heaven. Oh my goodness, that coconut. <laughs> this is so friggin' good. <laughs> More expensive than Venice, but just as delicious. 
I genuinely think this is maybe the clearest city river I've ever seen. <laughs> I can see the plants like a good couple of feet down, like just swaying in it. It's cute little boats in it, it's so greeny blue. This place is beautiful, isn't it? Mm -hmm. uh, I'm not gonna lie, I don't, I didn't really have much expectations, so I'm really, really like pleasantly surprised. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And I'm sorry if I had any preconceived notions. Yeah, like the roads are really good, it's really clean, the people are friendly, mm -hmm. it's got great infrastructure, the buildings are gorgeous, everywhere's green, the sun's shining, maybe mm -hmm. a bit too strong. I'm rating this place and the old town in Ljubljana, that's what I'm going to call it, because <laughs> that sounds right to me, feel free to correct me. But the old town seems really legit, like it's really cool. It seems really alternative. A word I would use to describe it is like a trendy or alternative. It is pretty trendy. It seems like every store or every other store is like organic, mm -hmm. handmade stuff. Yes, Lavinia, well done. Yeah, you better take this off me because I've just ate it all. I'll go ahead and give this city like a solid 9 out of 10. Just lose a parking too. We could have brought the van right in. On the weekends, parking's free. Real? Oh my word, can this place get any better? Yeah, really, 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 really loving this place. It's good. Um, why only 9 and not 10? Well, because if I said 10, you'd be like, you can't give anywhere 10. Always room for improvement. Yeah. Okay, we're going to go explore some more, but honestly... I'm loving this. It's really, really, really good fun. Really, really, really good. Where's the key building? Where? Oh, Where's the key really? building? It's so annoying. So we managed to escape the sun for two seconds. The sun completely wipes you out. Yeah, I feel so fatigued. We've been drinking water, making sure that we're staying hydrated, but it's still like we're just conked out. So I know there's like a lot more to see here. I know there's Trivoli Park, which is literally just behind us, but the thought of walking around the park makes me want to cry. <laughs> so <laughs> we need to Go find a body of water because man, I need to cool off. This ain't natural. That sounds like a plan. So we're gonna leave this city. It's absolutely beautiful. Really, really, really recommend coming and checking it out if you're coming through Slovenia. But we gotta make our way towards Croatia. Hopefully, stop off somewhere nice along the way. Yeah, get a swim. Yes. Sounds good. We'll see you back at the van. At least we're we're safe and sound. We live to fight another day. It's very hot in this van. This is what happens when you park in the sun. 41 degrees in this van. <sighs> Onwards. So it might be a little bit weird that last time we seen you we were in the van and now we're in a random forest but we've driven about an hour out of the city and we found a river and apparently you can swim at and guys it is way too damn hot so we need to submerge our bodies. Submerge! How great is this man? This is cute. Am I just jumping in? I guess so. It shocked me how oh, cold it was. <laughs> Flipping heck, that is fresh. Oh, it's really not getting much better, so the quicker you get in, the quicker I can get out. Whoa. <laughs> Be at one with you, too. Be at one. Oh. Oh I'm trying to figure out how I'm going to get out. Can you yourself up? Climb? You're a climber. Oh, almost Come did on. The, almost did a muscle. Up. <laughs> Look at that ass. <laughs> Go on, Keely. <laughs> okay. And catch. Ah! <laughs> okay. Are you stuck? Yeah, I'm a bit stuck. Okay, come on. We adjust a bit lower. Oh shit. Pain 
lunch. <coughs> Hello. Oh, got it. Good at Croatia. <laughs> it's now dusk time. We've just had some food at the last Lidl's before the border. So we're ready to cross into Croatia. Fingers crossed everything goes well. So far so good. Let's hope that it stays that way. Touch wood. Man, it's been a long ass day, hasn't it? It's been crazy. I can't believe we that we, we rode that Italy. boat this morning. We what? were in Italy this morning. That's mad. Let's go. We're here at the border, guys. No cues. Let's hope everything's okay. 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 So Leave your ice passport? You turn it and go back on the highway. Thanks Brexit! This is what we get. We're not allowed to go through half of these borders because we don't, we're not European citizens. So, we got rejected by that border because we don't have British passports. As you know, I have an Irish one. We were just going to go to the other border because Philly doesn't have one. Hi. <laughs> I have uh, my Irish passport. No, but he's my husband. Hello. Yep, a certificate. Can you give him her ass passport and now they're asking for a marriage certificate. So we're just looking for that. Thank you so much. Perfect. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> ah! We said borders weren't stressful anymore. See, uh, Philly was right. Philly was right. Philly right. was bloody right. Philly was right. Philly but, was right. But Philly was also. I'm gonna slap you. Philly was right. Philly was also like. Right. Is that what we're gonna say? We're in Croatia? <laughs> Absolutely filled our bin with vomit. So we were going to update you guys last night when we got to Zagreb. Um, well, we're in Zagreb, but when we stopped the van, Kelly jumped in the back and started being like violently sick constantly for a good two hours, and then throughout the night as well, um, just constantly getting up and peeking into our bin. I don't think this girl has any energy in her. <laughs> Dear lover, no. it's all right, we got you. Please send her some love in the comments. So last night when we crossed the border, they rejected us first because we both handed our British passports and because of Brexit, we're not technically European citizens. So yeah, they told us to go to the main border because we were like avoiding tolls. So it brought us to a little border off the road. Uh, so then we turned around and decided that we'd go back to that border and try with our Irish passport. Because a few videos ago, um, as you know, Keely has an Irish passport. My application's still ongoing. Um, but somebody in the comments said about if one of us has an Irish passport and we're married then Schengen shouldn't really apply to us. So we decided to try that with the border and it worked. So we hunted for our marriage certificate and we showed them Kaylee's Irish passport and they just waved us through. So if any of you guys have a partner that is a European citizen, that works. And I'm just glad that we know now. So please stick with us. You know, hang around. We appreciate your company. Oh, sweet mercy. Oh, you're up. I shouldn't have sat up. I wanted to say, I wanted to say bye. I have regrets. Um, please subscribe, like, and comment, and uh, join us next week. I need to lie back down. Love you. Uh... Thank you guys for watching. Peace.